Welcome back everybody, Canadian Silver Saver here in another fun video. This one we're going to be uh, doing a new series here, starting off here, the visiting the old vault. And uh, this one I'm actually going to be reaching out to the community there because there's something special that is within my possession that due to circumstances comes my way, but I don't always know the history or the reason uh, behind the product being made, who makes it, and uh, I'm actually looking for a little help on this because I've spent some time trying to research these and I couldn't find them. So I have a bunch of these silver uh, they're like plates. They're, um, they're 12 ounces each. And uh, let's take a look at them. And they're, you know, silver certificates, silver, uh, you know, s silver dollars are called on here as well. But um, I don't. I know, I know the ideas you see there, they're, like here's a one million dollar one. Uh, you can see it says uh, three nines fine silver. And I'm very, I'm doing my best here. Um, there's a, obviously a huge amount of reflection and, and whatnot going on, so it's a little hard to actually um, get a lot of detail on this without showing too much of, it's like a mirror. Um, but these are cool. Uh, they don't have anything on the edges uh, here at all. Um, this is, uh, there's nothing that tells me where it was made. Uh, they each have a different design, so there's the million dollar here. You've got the, um, you know, basically mimics uh, one, you know, one of these replica bills here. Um, gives you the year. Let's take a look at the next one. I think this one's got the same back. So that's, I said, that's the same. So these are both the million dollar ones, so there's two of those. Um, this one's the hundred dollar bill, so this is a replica, replica of the US hundred dollar bill. Uh, very cool piece. I think that's awesome. Um, there's the ben Benjamin Franklin, so that's why I said all the Benjamins there, because there's a good uh, few of these in here. And I don't know anything about these. There's nothing on the edges on any of them that tells you the mint or, or really anything about the, the product at all. Uh, and they're beautiful. They're heavy. They're weighty. Uh, like I said, they weigh about 12, uh, 12 ounces each, just over 12 ounces each. Um, there's another $100 one here. This one's a little bit different, uh, a little bit rough, more rough shape. The toning's kind of happened funny on this one here. Got this down here in this area here. Uh, see up in the top. Now these aren't in cases, um, so obviously they would be uh, much better conditioned, but that's how they were obtained, so that's what you get. Um, and this one's cool, $1, so silver certificate, which is what it was before. It was made by the Federal Reserve, right? So. Lots of good videos out there about that already, but um, one silver dollar, 2003. This particular one was made, and uh, um, this guy here, three nine silver, and it's fine silver, 2003. Silver certificate, five dollar bill, replica of the five dollar bill. Um, I don't know my U.S. bills out there, so help me out, everybody. Let me know what's what's this one about. Who's on the bill? Um, five dollars. Here's the man, Washington D.C. We've got the treasurer signal, so it's a replica, right? And then on the back here, uh, United States of America, five silver certificate, five dollars. Very cool piece, but again, I don't know anything about these. Um, they are really cool to have. And, uh, you know, through circumstance, uh, if sales and auctions and stuff like this comes by your way, but the, um, the, I just don't know anything about the, it's a nice little, more big chunky silver bar there that we got, but, um, I think they're absolutely beautiful and I th stuff like this is fun to have. And if you can, uh, I have no idea what they, you know, they would go for. Um, I'm really trying to do a bit of research and see if maybe this can be something that I can move along. Um, but yeah, beautiful pieces and I just don't know what, uh, uh, one of these times where I'm completely stumped on something and um, I certainly don't know all there is to know out there in the markets and I do come across things I've never seen before. Um, but I can usually look it up and find things and or I've seen a little bit about them. I've seen the ones that are thinner than this, I've seen the ones that are about uh, five ounces I think and eight ounces uh, but these are chunky bars and uh, anything that I've looked up a lot of times they say they're copper um, these ones aren't they're silver so you know it's really interesting 
um, to, to, you know, I'd love to know what's actually here. Just a beautiful piece and really makes the stack interesting and be able to pull these out and, and have a conversation and talk about them. It's a lot of fun and this is what makes me love what I do. So uh, let me know. I'd really love to know about these and if anybody's interested, I'd love to, uh, they might be able to find a, a new forever home, right? So, uh, but at the same time, they're fun to uh, enjoy and once I actually find out a bit more about them, I might uh, they might be staying here for a long time. So. Uh, thanks for hanging out today, everybody. Uh, throw those comments down below. Help me out. Let me know what I've got in hand here. Uh, smash that thumbs up button. Hit that subscribe button. And uh, stay tuned because I've got a lot of fun stuff coming up. All right. Take care.